What's going on, folks? What's going on? It's your boy, Aristotle, Full Throttle. Everybody comment where you from, all right? Everybody comment where you from. We're going to get started. While I send this message to my Discord, y'all know what time it is. We're going to talk about stocks all day, every day, all night. We might even do a Q&A at the end, all right? So let's see where everybody from. We got Boston, Miami, Crenshaw, Baltimore, uh, Prayers for Baltimore, Jacksonville, Florida, Charleston, South Carolina, everywhere. Okay, I see y'all. I see y'all. Okay, okay. So y'all know what time it is. Today we're going to talk about stocks. So let me go and bring up Trading View. Let's see where else we from, Nashville. Shout out to everybody. Also, if I made you money during Stock Sundays, comment me. All right? We need to tap into the people. I want to see who, uh, who's who been positively affected by this. Who's been positively affected by this. So if I made you money, comment me. All right? While I learn where you guys are from, Ohio, Texas, New Orleans, okay? Lit up, lit up. London, nice. All right. If I made you money, comment me. Tell me how much. And then we're going to move on. All right, we got some people. Me. Twist, talking about me. Reggie, me. Nolan, me. Raymond, me. Ronnie, me. Ryan. Okay, there we go, Pierre. Everybody making money. There we go, folks. So you have it right here. The proof is in the pudding that this show actually works. This show has been teaching. Uh, say learn if you've learned. Comment learn if you've been learning from Stock Sundays. You have learned a lot about the stock market, how to chart, everything, all right? That's what I need to see. I need to see some me's and I need to see some learns, all right? Hell yeah, everybody, me, me, me. You see that? Somebody said, damn, a lot of me's. I'm all ears. Where he said that at? <laughs> yeah, it is a lot of me's. Oh, there it go right here. My boy Rumble said, damn, a lot of me's. I'm all ears. That's right. All right, let's talk about it. Somebody said 2K off Stock Sundays. Somebody, everybody learning. There we go. Everybody learning. Somebody said learn a lot. Somebody said 2K. There we go. Learn, learn, learning. Okay, there we go. There we go. There we go, folks. Somebody said, I'm in the Discord. Learn. There you go. All right. So this is what we're going to talk about. We're going to talk about uh, a few things, folks. So we're going to get into the chart. Since we already done tapped in with y'all, we're going to bring this chart to full screen. We're going to talk about the uh, my favorite three setups. All right. So first setup that I like, let me see what I wrote down, if I can remember them. It was PTLR, Plain Tier Tech, I believe, or PLTR. PLTR, that was called? Yeah. Plain Tier Tech. So what do we have here, folks? Someone comment and tell me what pattern do you see? All right. Someone comment. Someone comment and tell me what pattern you see. Let's see if y'all been paying attention. See if somebody get it right. I'm going to wait. Give y'all some time. What pattern is this? Let's see who be paying attention on Stock Sundays. What chart pattern? Somebody said everyone signed up. It's the real deal. Let's see. All right. There we go. Head and shoulders, head and shoulders, head and shoulders. There we go. Y'all y'all doing good. There you go. Stock Sunday is doing good. The people on Stock Sundays, y'all are learning. We got some headhunters in here. There we go. Check out all these smart people. Check out all these smart people. So you guys are correct. Head and shoulders. I love it. All right. So I see a, a very, you know, put situation here. It has a gap to fill. And we'll go in and look at their balance sheet, see if this was a fluke anyways. They 
beat earnings. So let's go see. So anyways, let's go look at what pattern we see. Head and shoulders. So y'all see that? So here's the pattern we see. We see a head and shoulders pattern, right? Just like everybody talked about on Stock Sundays. Good job, people, in the comments. Y'all should give yourselves a pat on the back. You guys are learning. All right, so we have a head and shoulders pattern on Plain Tier Tech. Now, I should have got in puts yesterday. Uh, that's on me. I hate missing certain shit like that because I would have just gone ahead and got in puts there. But it's good to see that it's forming because you're really not supposed to get in until um, – where the neckline? We'll just say this is the neckline. All right. Or this is the neckline. Maybe it is already kind of breaking. So we got a. Depends on how you want to slice it. This could be the head and shoulders or this could be the left shoulder. One of these two is the left shoulder. Then we got a head Then we got a right shoulder. So this is a bearish chart pattern that could potentially fall if it breaks this line. You see that we got a left shoulder head right shoulder so this is called our neckline as you can see right here so we got a neckline and if it breaks this neckline it could be a potential breakdown so this could be a a, a nice put action play it was another one i liked i forgot to write them down so yes and we got a little gap to fill let's go look at their balance sheet real quick real quick one more. I got one that I like, but I had another one that I like even more. We got two. Oh, yep. I, I know exactly which one we're gonna do. All right, so we're gonna we're gonna do Yahoo Finance though. Yahoo Finance. All right, so we're gonna go to Yahoo Finance. We're gonna look at PLTR balance sheet. All right. So we're going to go to financials. And we're going to see if they are falling. Oh, no, they are rising. They had a um, a profitable year, 2023. Let's see their quarters. And they are rising quarter after quarter. So uh, that's not a good sign for um, the, uh, the technical say bearish, but the balance sheet says bullish. So we'll see about that. So let's move on, folks. But yeah, I will say that that's pretty dope. And that's why I, that's why I tell people you never know when a company is going to uh, start to because you got to think this company was not profitable. If we go to the annual balance sheet, they were not profitable for since 2020. So that's where you come in and see which company has the best um ability to turn a profit and as you can see this company has now turned a profit it, they were making so this is in thousands so you got to add three zeros to every number you see and as you can see this company w was losing 1.1 billion 2020 uh 520 million 2021 so they're losing less and less and less which is a good sign I know you guys like what well, they're still losing, but if somebody's losing less to some investors, that breeds optimism. Uh, put a yes if you understand that. Like people losing less is good over time. All right. And then quarterly. And now they're starting to rise quarter after quarter after quarter after quarter. So now it's up to you to go see, OK, is this a fluke? Is this certain rise in profit a fluke? And then that's when you go in and you go to places like Seeking Alpha. You go to Seeking Alpha and then you go type in the stock PLTR. And then you got to go see what what news is out. All right. So what's going on? And that's what I do. I just go down a rabbit hole after I look at the chart and I go look at the balance sheet. And I go look at what news hits, um, what news happens, right? So it might be a fluke. It might not. We don't know. I got to, you know, do a little bit more research. It only takes about 20 minutes, though. You know, you got to skim through these articles, go see what the analysts are saying. Then you got to go do even more research, check the cash flow statements, things like that. They are a positive cash flow. 
so they do have positive cash flow all right so they do have money to invest in themselves things like that you want to uh, check out all right let's go to the next stock that i see like i said we have um a bearish chart pattern but that doesn't mean unless it breaks this neckline it doesn't matter let's go to the next one my favorite setup is something that i already kind of profited off of but um chewy one of my favorite setups right now i believe they are a uh, pet food um so yeah you know you gotta know the pet industry so we have bullish divergence and we have a pretty much beaten and battered stock that could who knows so far it has huge bullish divergence though chewy would be my favorite setup for continuation um we've been rocking this same setup for a minute so chewy would be it uh pretty much beaten and battered possibly could uh could be a leak play if i'm not mistaken and then even on the weekly chart this thing has bullish divergence on the weekly chart as you can see so that's another reason why i'm like okay this could be a potential long swing here let me wipe off my video camera all right you see that that could be a a long swing bullish divergence on the weekly chart as well so I'm liking Chewy would be my favorite setup uh, for possibly a long swing to be honest maybe some leaps beaten let's go look at their uh, balance sheet let's go look at their balance sheet folks beating up Chewy so this is a, a pet I guess pet food right um, I would have to go look at their uh, description I'm not mistaken, this is a pet food company. Chewy, there we go, here we go. Chewy, and then you gotta go look at this sometimes. Scroll down, look at this. This is their company uh, thing, full-time employees, 19,400. So that's another thing, folks. Everybody always talking about these big corporations and what they not doing for people. These people, billionaires, employ people. See that, folks? This is what companies do. They employ people. Chewy, together with this, what you call engaged in a pure e-commerce e business in the United States, it provides pet food and treats pet supplies and pet medication and other pet health products, as well as pet services for dogs, cats, fish, all of that. All right, cool. So that's what they do. So now we know their business model, so you can kind of get an idea of what we're investing in. You always want to know what industry you're investing in. All right, you can't just go and look at a chart and be like, okay, I like this setup. Okay, what does this company do? What do they stand for? What What is their industry? Is the industry oversaturated? Do they dominate the industry? So let's look at their net, what you call it. As you can see, they are losing less money, kind of like playing tier tech. So that's good news. They are starting to turn a profit. All right. They are starting to turn a profit. Cool. And then if we look here, quarterly statements, they are um, kind of choppy, but at least they're having a better quarter than last quarter. And they're loose. So it, it doesn't, they're making progress and then had one minor setback and then for a major comeback. So it looks like the trend is upward as far as quarterly annually the trend is still you know they took a bump in the road but it's still profitable overall so now you gotta go and again i go to seeking alpha for the most part then i go to chewy you can go to uh, all types of places yahoo finance seeking alpha uh cnbc you can check them out too cnbc uh news uh, here we go this one so you can always go there too. type in uh, here we go with this shit do I gotta uh, here we go with this of course typical pop-ups chewy oh I already typed it in so by the drop 
you know, I go and look, I would probably choose this one. Why would you want me to buy the drop? Oh, here we go, another sign up for this type shit. But yeah, uh, I like Chewy. The next one that I like is, now this one is speculative, but I'm gonna tell you why I like this one. So we're still on a weekly chart. So everything equals weekly candles. A firm. So a firm has this huge bull flag on a weekly chart. And if you don't know what a bull flag is, um, here you go, folks. Bull flag. All right, so here's a bull flag right here, as you can see. We got a flag pole and we got a flag channel. So by definition, you need a flag pole and a flag channel, right? So let's see more examples. See that we got a we got a uprise flagpole, and then this thing just goes from there, right? So that's what I see with affirm. We got us a flagpole, flag channel. This thing could explode from here, and affirm did something crazy like a year ago. Yeah, this one right here, this thing like went crazy a year ago, and then. Went up to 157, dropped down here. Now, this company, if I can remember, is not profitable. But we can go and we can check it out. So that's the only thing about this company. Not profitable. Let's look at their business model. All right, I'm not going to read all that, but we're going to try. A firm holdings incorporation operates a platform for digital and mobile first commerce in the United States, Canada, and internationally. The company's platform includes point of point sale payment solutions for customers, merchants. I've heard of a firm because that's that thing that you gotta um verify before you pay for something, right, baby? A firm? Like PayPal? Uh they do it in increments. It's like a payment situation for payment. In increments, okay. Okay, that's what my wife's saying. Okay pay for over time with terms yep that's what it say too mm -hmm. it lets you pay in increments the company has active merchants cool so we know so they are buy now something later whatever and they and they employ this many people okay and there's their website and they're based in san francisco california so fintech is pretty much what they are financial tech fintech so we go to their finances. They are getting crushed. They are getting crushed. You know, and that's neither here nor there. But yeah, that's not good. They're losing more and more. So this is not a good sign for a company that just IPO, losing more and more money, getting crushed, nearly down a billion last year. Trailing 12 months, they're losing less than... uh the last year's one, yeah, they are getting crushed. So that's not optimistic for for that bull flag, but is it worth like maybe like a cheap risk? So here's what it is. When I see stuff like this that I don't, so are they losing less and less? Yes, they are. They are starting to lose less and less quarter over quarter. So that's probably the, the, the positive sign, but they do have a good chart pattern. So this would be like a speculative one. One of those ones where you like, okay, am I going to take this risk on this bull flag? You know, who knows? This thing could pop. I mean, this thing could really, really pop. Like based on the chart, it says it's coming here. Based on technicals, it's saying this thing is coming here after this breakout. This thing could get to $70-ish. That's what it's saying. I'm just letting you know. All right. That's what it's showing me. So affirm. Make sure you guys leave a like and a subscribe. But yeah, man, make sure y'all, if you really interested in learning the fast way and all of this sounds like Chinese to you, uh, for $35, you could participate in my Discord. All right. And this was last week when I posted the 41K game. This week was kind of short, so I didn't make as much as uh i wanted to but we did make some good progress like this week i don't think we lost we was taught see look we got in chewy 
24%, you know, and I let them know why I get in everything. So everything I get in, I let you guys know. Comment the word trial, and I will DM you the link, and you will get a, a beginner's course. If you are a rookie and know nothing about the stock market and want to learn in days quickly, if you want to learn the stock market quickly, comment the word trial or click the link in the description. If you're on YouTube, follow the six steps. Come to read first in my score. Follow the six steps. Give it some time. Remember, folks, this is a commitment. So don't be the one who like, hey, I'm going to come in and give it two days. And if this don't if I don't get rich in two days, then think about it, folks. It took me three years to save my first million. So for all of you like Aristotle, can you make me a millionaire in one year? I can't do something for you that I couldn't do for myself. That'd be another thing, too. It took me three years to save an M and people want me to make them a millionaire in one year. You get what I'm saying? So if you want to learn the fast way and you want to learn how I'm making money, um, tap in. Also, we have live trading every day and we scribe our live trades. As you can see, we scribe our live trades. You see that? So we tell you when we're in something and then we tell you when we trimming and when we get out. You see that? So that's another thing. And we show our gains. You see how he showed what what he's in? And then, so that's another thing. You can get in everything we get in. You can copy our trades verbatim. So you can make what we make. We have a small account challenge. So not only do we cater to the big guys, we cater to the small guys too. We day trade. We do all of that every day. And we host uh, Q&As every weekend. So for everybody who like, okay, when will I get to talk to you on Friday? We do a, a Q&A every Friday. It's mandatory now that we do a Q&A with all of the members. All right? So you can't lose. We have uh, free courses where I'm teaching celebrities, too. So, you know, as you can see, you can come learn, too. So I taught DC Young Fly from scratch how to trade. You see that? So if you don't know the candlesticks and all of that stuff, come learn, folks. It's only 35. Remember, folks, you're getting over on me. I'm not getting over on you. For $35, these are the type of gains I can return you. Look, these are people's gains. Consistency. You see that? This person's everybody, no matter who they are. You see that? This person made that in a day. And they're probably paying $35. Are they on a the trial plan? Yes, they are. So they're on that $35 plan that you guys will buy. You see that? That trial? It's the same plan. This is somebody just like you. This person. Account is up 79% in three months from us. All right? This person. Account is up 136% in a month. All right? So you're asking me, anything you pay me, I'm going to give it back to you. Okay? So you're basically in free. So that's for anybody investing yourself. You got to think, how will you survive during the next pandemic? My folks going to survive. But will you? Will you survive? So I could teach you how to survive with us. Everybody getting money, as you can see. Even then, look at this person. But what, what plan are they on? They're coming to learn. Everybody getting money. I love it. Look at this consistency, folks. That's what we do. We we teaching people the fast way. Nobody can teach how to how to get started in this game faster than we can. All right. This is it's all about speed, right? Aren't you guys the popcorn society? You want to get in and learn fast? Come in, go to read first. You'll be ready in, in days. If you apply if you follow the six steps, it won't take you long. If you follow if you're dedicated, if you really want this shit, if you really want a second stream of income and you want to start getting this type of this type of money, tap in. That's all I gotta say. If you want to learn how to get this type of money, tap in. We getting money over here. God bless you guys. Um and I'll open it up for QA. I open it up for Q and A. We're gonna start doing that now, but only on for the YouTube people.
So YouTubers uh, ask me questions. YouTubers ask me questions. Here we go. How much do I need to uh to get started? Um, I would say maybe like two thousand, one thousand dollars. All right. Somebody said, sign up, everyone, in the chat. Get in money. 35 ain't nothing. It's real. Exactly. If you complain about that, you're crazy. You got to think about the, the return on investment I'm going to get you. You have to spend money in order to make money. I don't care if you're the weed man. I don't care what you are. You have to spend money to make money. Oh, before we even keep going, while y'all checking, while y'all giving me questions, let's go look at Spy real quick. We forgot to even check out Spy. Way too damn high. This is ridiculous. I'm talking about just a freaking... We have to have a pullback soon. But remember, folks, we take the staircase up and the elevator down. So we drop faster than we rise, as you can see. See how, how fast this rise is, but look how quick the drops are. So let's look at some questions real quick. Um, How long do you set up the plays for? A uh, week or two weeks um, depends. It could be. A, it really depends. If it's a day trade, it could be a day. If it's a swing trade, it could be a few days to a week. It all depends. I love the Dr. Umar interview. Thank you. Thank you. See, look, somebody said for real. My first month, I was up 14k. That's what's up, my brother. God bless. Let's see. Uh, somebody said you paid every bill i had this month g shit that's what's up my brother i fuck with that god bless thank you aristotle what are the indicators you are consistently using these two the rsi and the macd and the stock market is oversold on overbought on the rsi on the weekly chart that's another thing Let's go to the daily chart. Yeah, this is crazy. This is insane, but we're going to see. We got bullish stock. I mean, we got bearish divergence on spot still. Bearish divergence, but this thing could just keep going. All right. How do you find your play? Uh, get in the mentorship. That's another thing, folks. We have a mentorship. Is it is it uh still ready for purchase or no? Tonight, okay. Well, I can't even talk about that. So, yeah. Uh, we're going to post a mentorship tonight. But later on tonight, folks, we got a class coming up. I'm going to show you what it is. Mentorship. So, it's this one. So, this is what we do. If you if you are interested in taking my personal mentorship, meaning uh, live classes, all right, so for the person who actually wants to learn, this is what we teach in the mentorship. It's eight days. It's a month. It's a four-week class, two classes per uh, week, and then a Q&A, three, three days of Q&A at the end. And here's what we do. We have four weeks of live training, meaning we don't do uh, courses. This isn't a course. This is a live training mentorship. Is dropping tonight, so um, be on the lookout for that. 30 days live, then you get 30 days live with it for free, and you get one week of Q&As, and then that equals profitable traders. So if you're interested in this in just, in just a month, I'll teach you trading in just a month, eight days, and, and well, really 11 days. I can teach you trading in just 11 days, okay? So if you're interested in that, it's only 1,000. But for now, for the ones who just want to get something quick, this is what you do. If you want to learn everything quickly, come into the chat, go to read first, and it's only 35. The return on investment I'll make you is way past 35. So don't so don't ever look at my prices and be like, man, that's expensive. That no, you're cheap. But you could spend this costs less than Jordan's, an iPhone, um, Damn near a date. 
I don't even know who if we can go go on a date these days for thirty five dollars. And people will tell me, man, your prices are too high. This is actually this is my prices are the discount. I want to give the average person the chance to invest. Look what I can make people. I'm I'm making people a hundred percent returns in a month. Hedge funds be promising people what five percent, ten percent a year, if that eight percent and and i'm i'm beating out hedge funds i'm beating out everybody every fund you could think of think about that so that's another thing too these are results from this week this is march this is march 28th it is march 31st so so don't play with it you feel me let's look at what somebody else doing He said, somebody said, I don't understand when you say somebody is getting over on you just because they copy your trades and make. No, no, no. I'm not saying they're getting over on me. I'm saying, look, you know how like some people charge. You know how some people charge people a lot of money, but they don't give them their ROI. So let's just say I, I charge you 10,000, right? But I can't, or let's just say I charge you 30K, correct, for what I know. But I'm not concerned with how you'll make that back. That's hypocritical in my opinion. I hate when people do that. And what I'm saying is that's not my business model. My business model isn't charging you an expensive price that you're going to struggle to make back. My business model is to charge you a cheap price and you're going to, and I guarantee your ROI. That way you're staying with me. For a long time that's my business model so my business model is actually backwards i'm actually wanting you to get your roi versus you not getting it if that makes sense and then you're spending this big chunk of money for no reason right, let's look at some more questions What time frame do you take your entries and exits? Um, it mainly the five minute chart. So if you go on trading view, you could just type the number five and press enter. So if you just hit the number five on your laptop or computer and then press enter, it'll take you to this chart. If you right click and you press reset chart view, you can kind of, you get what I'm saying? Get here faster. So this is where I usually take my entries and exits on a five minute chart. But I look at all time frames like the uh, one hour, four hour, um, one day. But it's a strategy to each time frame. That's another thing. There's a different mindset to each time frame. Now, does it take a while? We do teach that in the uh, mentorship, by the way. We do teach. Um. Where was it? Our secret setups. And then we teach time frames and all of that uh, in here, too. We teach swing trading. This is where we teach the time frames. Swing trading, day trading, and scalping on day four. So on the fourth day, you'll learn how to use every time frame. So that's coming out tonight, by the way. Um, DM me the word mentor and on Instagram if you're interested. If you're interested in getting on the wait list, DM me the word mentor and then with your cell phone number. All right. DM me and I might give you a call. So that's for everybody. If you're interested in getting in, DM me uh, and I'm going to call every person who DMs me. DM me the word mentor with your cell phone number. That's if you're serious about paying the 1000 All right. So everybody. DM me mentor with your cell phone number. And I'm going to make some calls, all right? I'm going to just be calling all you motherfuckers. Every last one of you. And we're going to talk about it. So one more time, DM me on Instagram, mentor with your cell phone number, okay? If you're interested in getting I'm going to give you a call. Look, I'm already getting them too. Everybody doing it. There you go. A mentor with your cell phone number. Okay, folks. 
and then we'll we'll have we'll just be telling it we'll just be giving everybody a call okay okay look we get a lot of dms too lots of dms love it see that mentor 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 i fuck, I fuck with it that's only if you serious folks only if you serious and then i then we'll talk about it but other than that folks y'all take it easy god bless y'all come into the uh chat and we'll talk about it see y'all later